we recommend three steps of maintaining your fatfish. Special design anchor is for retrieving task. Pulling P3 only at the anchor end of the tensor. Do not pull the hook between the plug and anchor. Make sure the remote controller in a safe and dry place. Wipe out the water on the surface of the tensor, then unscrew the drum plug. Have the tissue paper to clean the drum plug and make sure the plug is clean and dry. After you satisfy with the plug, unhook the anchor. Remember to put on the protective cap. Check the surface to see if there is any damage. Check the thrusters, both horizontal and vertical. Do not put your finger inside the thruster. If there are entanglements, you can use a pencil to help you out. You can check the tensor to see if there is a scratch or wiring. Remember to clean the remote controller with a soft clothes and take out the smart device when you finish the cleaning. Second, soaking and rinsing procedure. You need to immerse the drone into the fresh water in case there is sand trapped inside the drone. You can soak the P3 and shake it hardly to let the sand drip out. Repeat this procedure until the water dripping out is clean and clear. After you satisfy with the sand cleaning, we recommend one hour soaking. Submerge the drone, drone plug, tensor anchor in the fresh water. In case the solid crystallization issues, we recommend twist and pull the screw cap before rinsing procedure. In order to get rid of the plankton, we recommend rinsing procedure as well. You can use the fresh water to rinse the drone plug, tensor anchor, and the drone. And remember to wipe out the water on the surface. You can put P3 vertically and have a soft close underneath the camera. Thank you for watching. See you next time.